Thank you for joining us for this second half hour of Local 3 News at 4. I'm Cindy Sexton. And I'm Greg Glover. David Carroll's off today. Well, one person is dead and two Hamilton County deputies are recovering from gunshot wounds. A kidnapping led to a chase. Our Grayson Gordon is in the studio with us. Grayson, tell us what you know. Greg, Cindy, we have spoken with the agencies involved and a witness to what happened. We know, fortunately, the toddler who was taken is safe and the deputies are recovering. Catoosa County Sheriff's deputies were caught out to a wrangled neighborhood just after 8 Sunday night for an armed domestic violence incident. The suspect, Tyler Roberts, was trying to leave the home with his 18-month-old baby. He and his girlfriend, who live in the house together and are both the biological parents of the toddler, were reported to have been fighting most of the day. The adult victim says he was threatening her with a knife and gun and held her phone from her. Deputies say Roberts hit a parked car and slashed the tires of the victim's SUV, preventing her from leaving the residence. Deputies tried to stop Roberts, but say he held up the toddler in front of him as a shield to the many weapons pointed at him. He got in the car and made it past the Tennessee state line when Hamilton County continued to pursue Roberts. Use caution, possibly armed. That's correct, also an infant and a child in the car. Their deputies deployed tire deflation devices and were able to stop the car on the interstate. That is when Hamilton County resident Lindsay Thornton went out to her front door to see what was going on, all caught on her ring camera. You can hear the sirens and commotion. That's why I walked very slowly, because I just didn't know what I was walking up to. She was able to capture this video of a heavy law enforcement presence on Interstate 75. Something is really, really wrong here. The Tennessee Bureau of Investigation is investigating and say Robert shot at deputies. You can hear these first moments on Broadcastify audio. Call fire, call fire. Call fire, call fire. Thornton and her fiance turned on the scanner, attempting to piece together what was happening. It's horror and very scared for those people because at that point had no idea that a child had been abducted. Deputies returned fire and killed Roberts. Two Hamilton County deputies were injured and are recovering. The toddler was not injured. TBI has taken over this investigation.